Yep, it's that day again. Hey folks, Redneck Vapor here. Got another hump day vape. Tonight, it's gonna be kind of a, I guess, a short one. Uh, my internet's down. I'm gonna try to upload this with my phone. I don't know if it's gonna work or not, so bear with me. Might be late. But, uh, anywho, I'm gonna do a quick juice review in here, real quick, like and in a hurry, because, uh, there's not much to say about it other than the fact that it's pretty daggone good. And, uh, I had it tipped upside down to try to get the last couple of drops out of it, but I'm going to talk about Strawberry Obsession by Good Life Vapor. As you can see, we'll make that pretty easy. It is empty. I've got the last little bit I've been able to salvage in my k Uh I did not drip this flavor because it's a 12 milligram strength, but I do have it in a k on my Phantom Brass Stingray clone. And as you can see, it's quite empty. I'm expecting a dry hit any minute. <laughs> so let's talk about it real quick. Um, on the website, it describes it as strawberry done right. This flavor is freshly picked strawberries straight off the vine. Sweet, succulent, strawberry fields forever. Throat hit, right on par for 12, the strength that I like to use on a tank, so I'm getting a good throat hit. Um, vapor production, probably just saw it. Pretty good. I don't know what the PGVG is, it's proprietary or proprietor, or blah, 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 whatever all those words are. But uh, flavor, I'm getting really good strawberry. I mean, it's just a... Uh, I'm not getting much cream or anything, so it's not really a strawberries and cream. It's strawberry fields. If you've ever tried a strawberry fields type of flavor, that's what this one is, pretty much. Um, but I'm getting kind of, the strawberry that I'm getting is kind of like a wild strawberry, just a little bit. I mean, it's got a little bit of a wang to it. That makes any sense. I've got a 1.3 ohm coil built in this K fund, just running it on a on a mechanical. But yeah, that's what I say about it. They got a new flavor on there that I didn't see last time I ordered that I want to get next time. I it's called a Red Berry Dream. Strawberries and cream. Never taste it so good. It's a trip back to your childhood with sweet strawberry and delicious cream. Some have said that it gives you the impression of a glass of sweet strawberry milk. I might have to get some of that stuff. That and right there sounds really good. But as far as the strawberry obsession goes, I like it. As you can see, if I can get it, empty bottles don't lie. Like I said, I've got it tipped upside down. I'm trying to get the last little bit out of it. But anywho, let's move on to something different here. Um, have a vape real quick. Let's see. I guess probably about time for a you know what. Brain fart alert! I threw this bottle in to substitute me slowing down on the uh, <coughs> the dragon that I've been vaping the hell out of. But uh, I gotta get me another order and get it up here quick. I'm busy, son. Anywho, I've got another video that I've made that I'll be uploading hopefully around the same time that this one comes out. It's a 
Vaping tricks gone bad because I suck at vape trick tricks. Vape tricks. But anyway, I kind of I'm gonna do a shout out. I'm gonna do a shout out. I've been watching this young lady for quite some time, seeing which direction she wants to go and this and that. And give me a second. Let me let me track down her info because I need to put it in the description because I'm gonna shout you out, girl. Here it comes. Where are you at? Mm. So unprepared. Let's do another brain fart. Brain fart alert! Uh, shout out. Going to uh, Abby Vapes. Y'all need to go check her channel out. Um, she's got... 129 subs right now. I've been sub for heck. I can't even remember. I've, been, I've watched every single one of her videos. But she, the reason I like to watch her is because she's going in the same direction I'm going, or that I'm always wanted to go. She's doing something different, and that's what I like to see. I like to see people out there doing something different, other than just. Plain old juice reviews, plain old device reviews. You know, there's nothing wrong with that, but every now and then, those get boring. So, she does this type of, and this is the reason I did my, my vapes gone bad thing. So, need to help me out, girl. Get Keep them videos coming up so I can learn something new. <laughs> Maybe improve my technique a little bit. Anyway, she does a Tips and Tricks Tuesday. And this week she did a ghost inhaling as a trick and tips on how to do it. Well, let's see if I can do one on camera for you right now. Woo, looky there. How'd I do, girl? Anyway, I'll leave a link to her channel down yonder. Y'all go check her out. Um, like I said, she's sitting on 129 subs. She definitely needs to get on up there, folks, because uh, she's got a good thing going for her. I like it when people want to do something different. So uh, there's your shout-out, girl. Um, as far as, like, the uh, liquid and everything goes, um, I keep doing a um, um, um thing going on. Hold on, let me do that trick again. Uh oh got it down pat girl I've been practicing I'll go ahead and warn y'all that's the only trick I can do <laughs> this guy right here sucks at vape tricks anyway it's gonna be a short one folks I just want to do that shout out I've got a vape tricks gone bad video that'll be uploading sometime whenever I can get the internet going right um, what else? I wanted to kind of throw this in here because I've gotten some messages from some folks over my two cents video. And I'll tell you what, if you message me asking me who I'm talking about, you obviously got a guilty conscience. But I'll go ahead and tell you who I'm talking about. I'm talking about all those wooden spoons out there. And you're sitting there going, what the hell is a wooden spoon? I'm talking about the wooden spoons. What do you do with a wooden spoon? You put it in a bowl and you stir stuff up. Well, the crotch box down there, the comment box, that's the bowl. You wooden spoons come in and you stir all that shit up and then you're right back out the door. Those are the ones I'm talking about. And I know y'all people have seen it out there. That's the biggest thing I was talking about in that two cents video. Is the people who come in, and there's some of them that will go down the line of comments and throw their two cents in on every single comment. Just to stir some shit up. So, those were the ones I was talking about, the majority of that. I need to grow the fuck up. Grow the fuck up. Don't nobody give a shit what you're saying. I don't anyway. You want to come over to my channel and start doing that shit? I'll ban you. I don't want to fucking put up with it. I'm not going to. I'm not losing no damn sleep over it either. Pfft. 
But anywho, that was my biggest message out there, all you wooden spoons. Hopefully I don't have any wooden spoons here on my channel. If I do, don't stir any shit up because you'll be gone just as quick as you do it. That's just me saying. Now I can understand if you want to, you know, share your opinion. That's fine. Opinions are fine. It's when you go in there and you start starting shit with other people because of their opinions. Everybody has a right to their own opinion. So that's the way it's going to stay on my channel. Everybody has a right to their own opinion. Don't argue with it. I mean, yeah, some things are just straight up wrong. I keep a glance on most of my comments. If I find something that's completely inappropriate, it's gone. Another thing. You spammers out there. Don't come to my channel and comment on every single video I got. Go, oh, we got those. Oh, we got those. Oh, we got those. Oh, we have pro tanks and aero tanks. Come find us. And they leave like a, a link or a, a Skype address or something like that. Don't do that shit on my channel. I ain't putting up with that. All right, now that I've got my little mini rant out of the way, I hope everybody had a good hump day. Um, didn't have a whole lot to talk about this week. The juice review was short and sweet. Strawberry says obsession from Good Life Vapor. Good stuff. I'll leave a link down yonder to their site. Y'all go check them out. They got sample packs over there, which in my opinion, if you're new and you're still searching for that all-day vape, Sample packs are the way to go because you can try four or five different flavors Kind of figure out what what sets into your wheelhouse or whatever. So Like always folks, I'm gonna end this up. This is Redneck Vapor. Y'all keep on vaping. I'll see you next time